Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Moshe bringing you guys another video. In today's video, it's time to talk about the conspiracies and what is going to happen at the end of Season 4. So as you guys can see, playing in the background right now is the missile launching. And uh, there's a lot of people asking questions about what does it mean exactly by this missile launching? Why did it happen? What is going to happen? And does this mean that it's the end of the Fortnite map? And that's exactly what we're going to cover in today's video. As you guys can see, the missile was launching. Everyone watched it. There was a lot of people that ended up watching it. It ended up being like one of the most trending things on the internet during the missile launch. This is a massive missile that we all knew was going to happen eventually, but we didn't know exactly what was going to happen. So we had to watch. Basically, we watched it live, which is insane for them to do something like this in a live theory. As you guys can see... One of the thrusters flew off, and first off, we're gonna start with the thruster. What does the thruster flying off mean? Does this mean that it's the end of Fortnite, uh, blah, 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 blah? No, the thruster is just a thruster. Everyone saw it land at Fatal Fields. They think that that means something because it landed at Fatal Fields, but it's just one of the rocket thrusters that hit Fatal Fields. Nothing about it, nothing's gonna change with Fatal Fields. That's all that we have for now. Now, as you guys can see, the rocket is going up just like a normal rocket normally would, but right here, it breaks off. It stops moving. We can see it's starting to fall. As you guys can see, it's starting to fall. It's making these weird noises, and then it turns around and aims directly at Tilted Towers. You're gonna see three laser, four, I think three or four laser beams come down. Um, I'm gonna pause it right here. As you guys can see, it's now facing the Fortnite map. There's laser beams coming out of it. Um, now, a lot of people were like, does this mean that that the blockbuster skin, exactly what I said before, if there's a super villain, the super villain would want to attack the most populated spot. So I think what he wanted to do was attack Tilted Towers. This was his whole plan. The Blockbuster skin's whole plan was to destroy Tilted Towers. The dev team didn't like Tilted Towers and stuff like that. They wanted to destroy it. It was just overpopulated and stuff like that. So it was ready to go. We're actually going to put this in slow motion. It was ready to go attack Tilted Towers. As you guys can see, we're going to speed it up a little bit. It shoots extremely fast, heading right towards Tilted Towers. And then we're going to slow it down right here we're gonna actually come in a little closer and we're going to see what this means now as you guys can see there's like lightning strikes and stuff like that the the missile is about to hit tilted towers there's nothing strange about it it just looks like it's ready to hit tilted towers but little did we know right when it gets super close to it there's a layer right here right before it hits right before it hits this spot it looks like it's a crack in time so something had to have happened with the time zone and people were thinking that it was a barrier that was protecting tilted towers there's a force field but it looks like a ripple in the time ended up catching the missile and the missile disappeared into the uh i guess another dimension or something like that and as you guys can see everyone was freaking out about this they thought tilted towers was gone but it did not even touch tilted towers it ended up going through a time zone and as you guys can see all these things right here this is like i guess the the time zone i don't know exactly how to explain like the universe and stuff but it was a ripple in time where it jumped from this universe to another universe and you guys are going to see it spawn in over here at Wailing Woods. Now what happens over there at Wailing Woods? We're going to speed it up, try to get it up to normal speed and we're going to cover it exactly. But first we're just going to cover what the missile did. It went through another time zone and came out over by Wailing Woods. Now once it came out by Wailing Woods, I think it was redirected to try to go back and hit something on the map but it was flying all over the entire map and then it hits another one. Now, while these things are just all happening, everyone's literally just sitting there watching the missile fly around the map, right through Loot Lake, comes flying above Loot Lake, ends up going straight up into the sky and breaks a fat crack in our universe, you guys. As you guys can see, in our universe, we have a crack in it. So if you guys haven't noticed, of course, just look up. You'll see a fat crack in the sky. And this is basically what it is. It's just a fat crack that breaks the... A lot of people think it's the atmosphere that it ended up breaking. But no, I think this is a warp. This is a time. This is my theory on the whole thing. That this is breaking the time. There's going to be things that's going to happen in the next few days. Where if you don't know about like space and things like that, this is one of the time zones. It, it rippled through the time zones. And this is still a portal where it's ending where we can actually enter through this and I think what it's going to be it's going to be kind of like a black hole where it's going to suck up the entire Fortnite map and we're going to get something new now we're either going to be sucked into the this little time thing and we're all going to be sucked into it and then find out a new map a brand new map either in the old times or the future and that's basically means this entire Fortnite map is going to be rechanged now I have uh, some other clues to back this theory up so let's go into those real 
real quick. So actually, if you come over here to the motel, one of the new spots that they added or locations that they added into the game, as you guys can see, the closer we get, listen, I'm not even gonna, oh, there's a llama over there. We're gonna get that llama here in a second, but I'm not gonna talk, but listen what happens when we walk closer to the motel. see we're seeing it looks to be like it ripped a hole in the motel sign and it's kind of just like the thing that we see up there now this this shows that something is happening to the map this was not here right after the meteor strike this actually came in today so this means that something big is about to happen and i want to show you guys another prime example of what i mean by this because this thing that we spot right here at motel we saw the same exact thing over here at lonely lodge if you come over to the sign at lonely lodge we saw the same exact thing over there but now over at lonely lodge the sign has actually disappeared which means these things are starting to get sucked into another dimension you guys because of this same exact thing was over at lonely lodge and the sign got sucked into it the next day that means this by the next day is going to be sucked in and there's going to be another location for this type of thing so stay tuned we're gonna try to find out exactly what is happening but these things are getting sucked and just disappearing into another dimension and that's exactly what i think this fat thing up in the sky is is i think it's one of these but 10 times bigger and what it's going to end up doing by the end of the season is that it is going to suck in the entire fortnite map you guys Guys, this whole entire map is going to be completely changed up and if you think about it the game developers have had this map i mean they did a big change i think in season i think three or maybe the start of season three is when they did a big change to the map and ever since then they've only done smaller changes like dusty divot and the meteor striking in certain locations and a lot of people are saying this game's getting boring it's the same thing so they want a brand new map and this is the perfect way to give the fortnite community what they want and that is a brand new map so i think this entire map is going to be remodeled now there's two options that we can have either one the the meteor or not the meteor but the the ripple in the sky is going to bring us into the past or it'll bring us into the future and i want to know down in the comment section below what do you guys think do you think that the fortnite map is going to go into the future or it's going to time travel backwards into the past oh my god look at what this guy did a port of fort on top of his stairway to heaven so a lot of people have been asking about that and that's why we've been seeing some theories at the start of the season saying that there's going to be old time skins coming to the game and that is because they've seen leaked files or something has been leaked where they saw like old fashioned skins coming to the game. So I think that's what a lot of people think is going to happen. Let's see if anyone's up there. Nope. Is we're going to be sucked into an old fashioned type of play style. Now in the trailer for the new playground mode, we ended up seeing that they kind of hinted towards an old fashioned play style coming to the game. And now these are just the little clues that has me thinking that my conspiracy about the whole thing, the crack in the universe, the space up there is going to end up sucking in the entire map and we're going to see a brand new map in the game. Now I want to show you guys something over at Lonely Lodge real quick. As you guys can see, it is extremely loud. Now, loud. Now, yesterday there was a sign right here with the same exact thing, but this thing is getting bigger. It's starting to crack a little bit more, and it looks just like that up there, but it's getting bigger every day. So this, holy crap, now that I'm looking at this, I think that thing in the sky is actually getting bigger too. It was never that long on that side. It, it's getting bigger each day. So each day we're going to see things disappearing on the map now this sign that was right here ended up disappearing this thing was just it's consuming it so pretty soon lonely lodge is going to be completely taken out motel is going to be completely taken out now those are the only two locations that we have seen this so far but it seems like every single day so far we've seen something new come to the game we've seen one of these little ripples in the time zone come to the game and they hit a certain location on the map now this has some people thinking that only certain locations on the map are going to disappear but then a lot of people forget about that up in the sky and that is big enough to take out the entire world where we're all going to end up disappearing so yes my theory is in season five you guys are going to be expecting a brand new map coming to fortnite we're gonna no longer see tilted towers lonely lodge uh greasy grove salty springs if anything it's all going to be changed into something different maybe what they're going to do is they're going to go back to the old fortnite map because we go back in time through the the time i don't know what to call that the ripple and the time 
zone that's going to end up sending us back in time and my prediction is it's going to send us back into time and we're going to see a whole bunch of old western type themes for season five so the skins that we're going to see in the next season are going to be i guess like egyptian skins pharaoh skins and stuff like that old old time type skins now i don't know exactly how far back in time that this is going to date again this could only go back to about a year ago and the map will only change to how the old map used to be but then again it could go back all the way back in time to the point where all we're going to see is like cowboys and stuff like that we're going to see horses and in the next season instead of shopping carts we might be able to ride horses and stuff like that but you never know because the possibilities are endless with this game but i wanted to bring you guys my conspiracy theory let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think is going to happen what do you think this means does this mean that the blockbuster skin was trying to destroy tilted towers but some of the heroes ended up saving it is that what this means that we got saved by the time like the rocket hitting a time ripple instead of actually destroying the map does this mean we were saved or was this all planned from the start now again let me know down in the comment section below give this video a thumbs up if you agree with my theory that this is going this is going to consume the entire map but guys thank you so much for all the love and support and i will see you guys in the next video peace